Hello guys and I hope doing well. These crafts are uh, the Hertz uh, graph. This is the project you can see and the project is Arduino based. I used Arduino Trimini. The main project I see is INA 128. This is one of the best ICs to draw uh, hair trade graphs. The analog converter is ADS1015. It's very easy and cheap analog digital converter. I use the analog pin number 2. A1 is the second analog pin number and the negative a connection maker and driver for the 128 INA 128 is LM358 is a metal version and finally this is project and this Bose is continuity Bose that when the uh, graphs going down it's mean that the guys on the monitor is dead so the project is very very simple and easy no need any special programming I'm going to the source code to check exactly so this is all information that I have here the first line is calling the library for the 1015 analog digital converter. Here is addressing everything coming with the sketch examples and just the output write it down over this formula. Exactly the current voltage we need write down at the serial. I'm going to the tools and take the serial plotter and this is my pretty graphs for the INA128 hertz rate, hertz bitrate drawer. I used um, the sensors like this for the uh, skin sensors. And a little bit gel hand will fix it and will make better resistance and connection with the skin. And this is my gel hand I'm using. But if you have the special galvanometer or um, any other gel for heart rate checking items, will would be fine. So I have. So uh, I would say that for the um, that for the schematic, no need any specially. The analog converter is standout connection. It's very easy to find out. The INA128 no need any special configuration. Just don't forget for the reference voltage connected to the ground and positive over 200k resistor. Pin 1 and 8 will adjust the drawing place at the graphs. You can look when I'm touching the uh, pin 1 and 8. The graph uh, position on the um, the position graph on the screen will be aligned and adjust. This uh, potentiometer, this part is uh, 5 mega ohm potentiometer connected to the pin 2 and 3 the pin 2 is connected to the right hand and the pin 3 connected to the left hand over 1 mega ohm resistors connected to the potentiometer and finally the output of INA 128 is connected to the analog input of the ADC 
converted. So for the left leg, we need one connection. This one is is connected to my left leg, and uh, now my position is not fine to take picture from my body and how the um, sensors connected to the, my body I'm not able to show you but we need one negative uh, connectivity you are able to connect directly the third connection to the ground or it's, it's much better to connect to ground over uh, LM358 to work this as uh, the alignment of 128 driver so it means that when the third sensor connected to the body the graphs also will align exactly at the center of the screen you can see when I'm unplugging the um, wire now is in other position of the screen so you can see exactly the graphs are the same it means that everything is set up exactly pretty well very well and so these graphs mean that my heart is working very well finally we have three connections to the skin one for left arm pin number three one for right arm pin number two and one to the left leg as ground connection you can directly uh, connect this wire to the ground or connect over operational amplifier to have best and amplified ground and visual ground or and driver of INA 128 screen XY position so by the potentiometer we are able to adjust the sensitivity of the IC and finally the code is running pretty well and the final thing that we should talk about this project is uh, that is much better to disconnect the Arduino from PC and connect it to the and connect it to the LCD TFT LCD and run it over battery because of with the um, because of with the um, AC to DC power supply of PC we have too much noise and this noise will make these movements like you can see here and we don't like this part for the um, normal uh, hertz graph but it's very easy to remove these um, movements by uh, simple filter over a capacity but uh, this part of the um, graphs is the thing that we need here you can see all graphs are the same one by one I'm checking and everything is the same hope to enjoy this project don't forget you are connecting your skin to the electricity and more than uh, one and a half volt will exactly affect your body and your head and mind and everything and be careful when you are working with this kind of projects sometimes the ground connections for the pcs for the laptop for the chargers is very dangerous for the body and don't forget to set up simple frequency to know the continuity and make one potentiometer to draw exactly ex excuse me to make exactly the bonsai song to know exactly the continuity is running well and we are able to monitor the head rate over INA 128 thanks for watching 
Hope you enjoy this video and goodbye.